This is the food chain, right? Catherine Smith Elementary School is a place where kids can come and we really focus on the whole child. We focus on their social emotional well-being, their academics, and all the things that come with that. We're also a hub of the community in the neighborhood and we pride ourselves on that. Everyone is welcoming. Everyone is willing to help at any time. The kids are wonderful. So if my son or daughter is not talking when I think they should, does that mean they definitely have autism? In 2012, we transitioned to doing project-based learning as a framework for our instruction. When we prioritized that, we started seeing students being able to work together in ways they hadn't before, being able to communicate effectively and engage in rich projects. What's 416 for minus 70? My favorite thing about our school probably is how our teachers work really hard, take the time to understand the project first and then they teach us. It's really awesome because we get to really go deep down in the projects and understand better. Because that's our project that we're working on. What is your favorite animal? If something's happening with us or we need help, they're always there for us. We want our students to be able to be kind to each other. We want them to work to solve problems, learn continuously, and make safe decisions. The PBIS supports how to correct and give positive behavior. The toolbox teaches 12 tools that help self-regulate and manage their emotions, and we also have restore practices and circles in which we teach students how to problem solve when there's a conflict. Our school is fortunate to benefit from many community resources like the Family Resource Center, the Neighborhood Safety Unit with the Probation Department. Love the school, love the teachers. They do have after school programs. And then a quick construction update. Another thing that I enjoy, parent pride meetings. It happens every Wednesday. There's coffee conversations and it's just a good time for parents to sit down and um, learn what's going on in the neighborhood as well as in the school. Have you been running it. It's important to think about school as a place where, yes, you learn how to read and write to prepare you, but you also need to be able to self-regulate. You need to be able to be confident and speak in front of other people, to be able to communicate effectively with the audience, and to be able to share your learning and take feedback. And so really it's the combination of all those things that we value that make this a special place.